What's up, Mirror here. Welcome to the first chapter of learning level design with Unreal Engine 4. In this chapter, we are going to cover how to use geometry brushes, or they used to be called BSP brushes, to build your levels. In the first video, we are going to go over a typical workflow, how you use geometry brushes to block out your level and how a level might look when you are done with it. In the second video of this series, we are going to start messing around with brushes. So in this one, you're going to learn about additive and subtractive modes and also a few other things. But by the end of this video, you will have a knowledge to build something. In the third video, we are going to apply all the knowledge that we learned in the second one and build an arch doorway. This is not that hard to do, but you're going to apply all the knowledge from the second video and use additive and subtractive brushes to build an arch doorway. And we're going to use a box brush and a cylindrical brush. And also we're going to go into editing mode to edit our brushes. Then we're going to duplicate that brush and build ourselves a room. And at that point, I'm going to uh, show you how to build the lights and how to control the light map density on BSP brushes. Then in the fifth video, we are going to learn about the pen tool, which is a pretty advanced tool to make BSP brushes. And we're going to build an arch doorway again, but this one is going to be just one brush. So it's the most optimal way to build an arch doorway, but it's also a bit uh, overkill to be honest, but the tool is there. And if you need it, you can use it. Then we're going to look at uh, hollow uh, brushes, which uh, are basically really good for building rooms since uh, you will have inside faces and uh, you just need to carve out a doorway if you want to get in. We're also going to go over other brushes that we haven't used so far in this video. By the end of this chapter, you will learn how to prototype the levels and you can start building your own stuff. And if you enjoy the videos, don't forget to subscribe to the channel, hit that bell notification thingy so you do not miss when I release new videos. And see you in the next one.